morning, good morning, my lovely viewers. Thank God it's Friday. Man, the week is moving fast. It's already Friday. The weekend is here. You know, we got to thank God. Every time you wake up, you go on the wheels, you need to thank God, you know? It's your boy checking in. BZ, Mr. Block Lord, Mr. Grab It and Bag It. Stake it till you break it. Dash it and stash it. We get, we get, we get money. You already know, baby. So many ways the ground will never stop on my mama. Always about the bag. Let's secure the bag. Let's get paid. Let's get into it. Guys, you're going for it. 85 likes on this video. Please subscribe. Hit that notification bell. So every time I drop a video, you, you, and you, and you are going to be first to watch it. And God bless you for watching my videos. Let's get into it. So today we're going to be talking about, we're still on that new pay model, DoorDash new pay model. It's not going to be sweet and spicy. I know some people like it sweet. Some people like it hot and spicy. You know, I like it mixed, sweet and spicy. Don't get too excited about this new pay model. You know, it's going to be different in every single market. You know, I'm just going to be talking about the pros, the pros and cons about this new pay model. The $2 payout is here to stay. DoorDash is collecting data. You know, so I'm suggesting to you guys, you keep rejecting this $2 offers so DoorDash do something about it. It's either they're going to bring back the additional pay or they're going to take away that $2 base pay, you know? So now, the new pay model is going to be, I mean, I'm sure you guys already know this. It's going to be a $2 base pay. The base pay includes time, mileage, and des desirability. You know, the desirability is, you know, what orders our drivers are like, you know? And also, the good thing about this new pay model is as soon as a driver rejects, the price keep bumping up. So whoever accepted last, it's still going to be a good offer. Because it's not going up, you know. The people who are who got the new pay model now are telling me they're making ten dollars per delivery, which is like two twenty twenty dollars an hour, which is very very great. Because with the new pay model, they say you're gonna see a two dollar to ten dollar per delivery increase, you know. But this is not gonna be for every market. Every market is gonna be different. In my market, I got good tippers. In some markets, they don't tip at all. They got bad customers don't tip. If you don't want to tip, go get your own food. It's that simple. No tip, no trip. You know, we work for tips. You know what? I, I just don't understand these customers, but it is what it is. Some people just ain't going to tip. They probably don't have money. I don't know what the reason is. You know, you don't have money, go pick up your own food. I feel like the minimum delivery got to be $10. That's how I feel. There should be no $2, none of that stuff. The minimum should be $10. But these companies are not going to do that. You know, they're going to allow the customers to do whatever they want. And the customers are abusing the drivers. You know, I don't mind. I don't mind. If I'm, you got to pay me for my time. You got to pay me. So the base pay is, is not really transparent, man. To be honest with you guys, the base pay is not transparent. Because we don't know how much time we're getting paid, how much mileage, and that desirability. desirability we don't know. It's not transparent when it comes to the base pay. I have a problem with that, you know? Even though the base space is not going to go down below $2, it's going to be $2 and up, they took away the additional pay, you know? So in a market where you get a lot of $6 offers with a new pay model, I'm sorry to tell you, you're going to be getting a lot of $2 offers, a lot of $2 offers because they took away the additional pay, you know? I feel, so, I feel sorry for those markets where the customers don't tip, you know? That's what I'm saying, you guys. The $2 payout is becoming permanent now, unless drivers do something about it. I know the employees who accept every single offer are going to keep on accepting this $2 offer, and though that's just going to keep it. We need to start, we, we need to keep rejecting this $2, $3, $4, $4 low offers. So DoorDash is going to do something about it. It's not even DoorDash. Every single company, Grubhub, Uber Eats, we should not accept this low office. You know, I keep telling you, you gotta go for the big ballers. It should be ten dollars minimum. I heard in DC, Carvia is like ten dollars minimum. You don't get nothing below ten dollars. I don't know if it's true or not, but that's what someone told me. That's what it is supposed to be. Customers should not be able to place food under ten dollars. It should be ten dollars minimum to you know to to what's it called to order food online. It should be ten dollars minimum. So we can at least get twenty dollars an hour, which is not me. You know, I want to make like at least thirty-five, forty an hour. 
but it's, it's impossible, you know. 25, 30, 35, I'll take it, you know. I just gotta work smart, multi app, you know. 1500, I wish I could make 1500 every week, every week. But it's not gonna happen. You got, you're gonna have some slow weeks and some good weeks, you know, some bad days and some good days, you know. But we're working on it. The goal is, the goal is like $400 every single day. We're gonna get there. We, we, we run it 250, 300, 350 every, you know, depending on the, the day is good or not, you know, but we're working on it, you know. What is your goal? Your daily goal? I know you, some people's goal is $100, 150 you know, it's up to you. I got bills, I got people depending on me, I got much goals, you know, I got bigger goals. I'm a boss, I'm not an employee. That's why I keep on preaching you guys to keep on cherry picking, you know. Do not accept this two dollar offers so it becomes permanent. They're gonna keep on testing it. If you don't have this new pay model, it's coming. It's gonna be live every nationwide at the end of this month. You know, it's not still in my market. You know, it's not my market yet, but it's, it's coming. It's, they're rolling it out region by region, area by area. So be patient. It's coming. I just want to tell you guys: don't get too excited. You hearing people? I'm hearing good feedbacks. Don't get me wrong. I'm hearing good feedback about this new pay model, but I don't mean it's gonna be for every market. Every market is gonna be different. You know, they're gonna they have the there's gonna they're gonna be having a lot of peak pays. You know, a lot of challenges. Where everybody say you deliver, let's say you know, 20 deliveries. You, you make ten dollars, twenty dollars. You know, you do. You know, I don't know. They, they're gonna do challenges. I've been seeing a lot of pick pays, but it's not it's not enough, you know, it's a dollar, two dollar, three dollar pick pays, you know. We should see more four dollar, five dollar, you know. And also every time they run those pick pays, you know, it's less deliveries. Because they don't want to pay us, you know. That's 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 just how it goes, you know. So let me know, you know, do you have this new pay model in, in your market? How's it going? You loving it? You not loving it? Let me know in the comment section, man. I can't wait. I can't wait to see it in my market. But I, I feel like, you know, it's not going to be all that, you know, sweet. It's going to be spicy too. You feel me? It's going to be spicy. I like it sweet and spicy. I like it mixed. You know, I know it's always going to be good and the bad. You know, so don't get too excited. You know, that's all, that's all I'm saying. It's going to be pros and cons. You're going to be seeing a lot of $2 payouts if you're in a market where the customers don't tip. You know, don't accept it. Do not accept those two dollar offers. So DoorDash will eventually, once they collect their data for the in continuous months or the incoming months, they're gonna do something about it or they're gonna bring back the additional pay. You know, cause it's 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 not good. The additional pay they took out is not good. You know, I'm not gonna accept into no two dollars. It's big ballers. You know, we're gonna accept those big ballers. We're gonna cherry pick. You know, item counts. You know know what kind of restaurants to accept their offers, you know, know what time to work peak, work peak hours, lunch time, dinner time. I'm sure you guys already know this, you know, but it's not going to be all sweet and spicy. That's all I want to say. And don't get too excited, you know, it's going to be pros and cons about this new pay model. You know, if you have it in your market line, market right now, let me know. Someone told me they're making $10 per delivery, you know, I don't know if it's true or not, but you know, that's great, you know, you're making $10 per delivery, that's very, very great. That's a whole other level right there, you know. That's a way increase because it was like people making $10, $12 an hour. So now if you're making $20, I feel like it's great. And I feel like it's not going to be for every market. Every market is going to be different, you know. Some people going to be making $10 per delivery. That don't mean you're going to be making the same thing in your market, you know. Every market is going to vary, you know. So I hope you have a good one. God bless everybody. Enjoy your weekend. I might make a video on the weekend. I don't know. Let's go out here and secure this bag. God bless everybody. Let's spread love around the world. Let's stop the hating. You know, you are the bag. Secure yourself. None of that low office. Know your what. Knowing your what is your what, man. So I hope you have a good one. God bless. And let's get it, guys. Strong.